Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Kirby's Epic Yarn. So let's get going. We'll continue on in the Dreamland. Well, that is unfortunate for that Waddle Dee. But oh my goodness. I like this. Cloud Palace. I, I like- I- I- I-, I saving. I like the, like, sky, in, like, in the cloud levels in Kirby games. Let's go in. Oh, I think this is gonna be interesting. Okay. Interesting in a good way, but not like... It, it's just not a cloud level that I was expecting. Also, hang on, this music sounds familiar. I remember this music. Let's grab all these beads that I can before the, the buttons go into the background. Into the void. Oh, hang on. Probably want to take this one. Right? Yeah. Oh, I need to... I need to grab you. Thank you. Also, I need... I need to... Whip my way up there. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Okay, there we go. <laughs> okay, and we've got these platforms here that bounce us around. Oh my goodness. Bounce me. Bounce me higher. Also, I probably can... Ground pound to bounce higher. To our first treasure up here. Cloud rug. That's actually a good one to have, probably. Lie down on this fluffy rug to feel like you're on a cloud... Uh, on cloud nine. Okay, let's go down. Anything that I missed? I hope not. I think I'm good. Ooh, let's go. Where am I going? Also, I feel like I could probably go into the... Thing there. That's not helpful at all, but I can do I can do that. Also, this song is cool. Also, can I please? Thank you. Oh, I see. The upper one is a lot harder to go into. Also, please. Also, please. Okay, there we go. Just a little bit further. Okay, good. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of work for a star bead. Okay, let's also be careful here because we can fall into the void here. And it will be bad for us. Oh, hello. I like beads. Do you like beads? I like beads. How do I get up there? Oh, oh, eh, 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 oh. Two of them disappeared. It's fine. That was close. Okay. <laughs> I'm just making everything more risky than it needs to be. Oh, hello, Cracker. Funny seeing you here. Oh my goodness, my beads. I'm gonna be in trouble in a second here. I'm just gonna run away. I think that's probably a good plan. Grab the beads. Please. Up here. Grab beads, more beads, more beads. Cracker, what are you doing to me? Cracker, what are you doing to me? You're just chasing me. This is so rude. Okay, I think we're good. I think. I hope. I want these beads, though. Where are we going? Where are we dropping, boys? Oh, hello. I'll take this, please. Star. I don't know if I want to follow this way or go this way. I might... Might look around. I can always replay the level if I need to. Okay. Yeah, there's a treasure up here. Good thing I went back this way. Fizzy Pop. This fizzy drink looks like it's filled with flavors. Try displaying it on a table. You can't tell me what to do. Okay, is there anything below? No, it's just loop. It just connects back here. Cool. I like when nothing is hidden from me. In a rude way. What's this? Oh, hello. Guess I'll grab that. Got the three star and the two star. I haven't got the five star, I don't think. It's difficult to tell, though. Oh, this is gonna end badly. Oh, this is gonna end badly. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Grab all these. Head on up this way. I think this is good, right? Right? Treasure? No, this is actually the way to go. Is there anything below me? That I need? Hang on. Okay, I see that patch. I want the patch. At the very least. Okay, that's the five star. Cool. We have... Most of the things that we need. But also, it's time to transform with a new transformation. I don't know what to call this. Just a... It's a... 
star shooter thing, so... It's like the sideways version of the rocket, except that the sideways projectiles only go so far, and also you can't focus your attacks, so... But this is still cool. We have our regular shots that go for miles. It didn't seem like killing those clouds gave me anything. And stuff does get pulled into you again, so that's good. Makes things easier. A little bit. Ah, my beads, my beads! Okay, just stay alive, my beads! Okay. Drop everything. Give me everything. I need to get gold on this part of the level, so... Oh, please let me through. Grab all those beads. I think it pulls stuff into you. Grab those beads. Okay, open up. Please let me through, let me through, let me through, let me through, let me through! Getting pushed behind. Go faster! Go faster, 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 go faster! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah, let's go up. I should have gone down. There's the disc there! That's fine. I wasn't going to have any chance of knowing if there was a secret there or not. Oh, hello, Cracker. Again. Just time with different attacks, but that's okay. It's generally the same. Get out of the way. I can hit you with my side things, right? I hope so. Okay, that's good. First hit. Or first level done. Oh, we'll back out. Nice. Okay, just be careful, just be careful, just be careful, just be careful, just be careful. Okay, level two done. Just one more. Oh! Dodge that. Okay, 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 okay. That's a lot of damage. Dodge out of the way. And I got him. Somehow. I hope he didn't drop anything. <laughs> I don't think he did. I guess the, the, the only thing I missed was the disc, and I have to replay the level for that. So, but anyway. It's the end of the level. Thank goodness that was enough to get to gold. Barely got cold by the skin of my teeth. That seems like the worst saying you could ever hear. By the skin of your teeth. Just don't think about that too much. You found the boxing glove patch. Very nice. This is actually really cool that it's giving us Castle DDD as a level, like this. But anyway, we'll get to that in just a second. I have to go get that thing that I missed. Okay, let's get this now. Not missing anything. Thank you. Theme from Bubbly Clouds. Also, there's a platform there I didn't see because it's just barely on the screen. I did a lot worse on beads that round. A lot worse. But it's fine because we already got gold. Now we have everything in that level. So now, let's head on up to Castle DDD. Which I think is really cool that it's just in the sky for some reason. It's not really explained, because you can see it in the cutscene floating in the air when uh, we see Meta Knight go into the patch first. Also, well, these cannonballs we can actually stand on top of by. I probably, I'm assuming we'll get hit if we stand on them when they explode. 
But also, this is just a really cool idea. They are spinning, so we have to keep up with them. But still. Gives us all the good stuff. Uh, let's go in here, I think. If it takes me to where I need to go, then I probably sh should go back. No, I think this is actually what I want. I think. Okay, so there's a painting there. There's Waldies here. So I need... Take the Waldy over here? Or maybe I... Oh wait, no, it's probably just to kill the enemies, right? Yeah, just kill all the Waldies and they'll take the thing over here and then it'll... It'll allow me to take it off. Right. It all makes sense now. Also, the music here is great. As, as Diddity's theme always is, so... Is it Diddity's theme? Pretty sure. I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna need you, so let's break that. Drop all these beads down. Very nice. Okay, what's this? Oh, hello. Funny, you should be here. Let's go in here, though. This looks like a secret. If ever I saw one. Okay, Baldy. Okay, let's destroy that. Destroy all that. Actually, I might destroy that over there as well. Also, there's beads up top that I could probably only get if I go slower with this. But also, I want... I can get most of them, sorry. I probably actually even get the ones up top if I do something like that, so. There we go. That allows us to open up this next painting of a Waldy. Okay. Castle Dedede. Someone put a lot of effort into this model of Castle Dedede. They sure did. But anyway, let's head back and continue on the rest of the level. See if I can actually make it across here. Like that, apparently. Okay, cannon. This has never gone badly for me before. Cool. Just gonna get rid of you. Oh, I need to be careful because I can get crushed here by the... Cannonballs. So I need to take it... Carefully. 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 I did it, somehow, without getting hit. Okay, what's up here? We have something up there. The, a door that I probably want to go into. But how do I get in there? I can't see above me. Okay. Okay. Okay, I wish I could see above me. Okay, okay, okay. This works. And now we can get into this door over here. Before destroying the blocks would be preferable. I imagine you could also get through... In multiplayer though. Probably. Also, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted! It's fine. We just step on top of you. Throw that up there. I should get rid of you. I hope. Or not. Well, this is just not working out the way I hoped it would. That's fine. Also, apparently that's the one I needed. Up top, not the other ones. Works for me. This is such a cool theme for the secrets in the level, though. Taking out all the enemies in each room. And you wouldn't have thought that in this game they could do that. But they did, so... Okay, up we go. Oh, that was the right way to go. Let me go back. Eh, touch it. Thank you. Okay, let's grab all that. We have gold now, which is good for us. Just need to go up a little bit more. Thank you. Also, I love the cogs in the background. That's really cool. Also, hello. Pull that out of the way and go in here. I think. I'm pretty sure this is just going to be a secret. I think if it's one of these particular doors, it's going to have a secret behind it. Oh, I need to be careful. If it's on your the same level as you, it's probably going to... These UFOs are probably going to shoot at you, so you need to be careful of that. Can I please hit you? Thank you. Um, oh, hello. Tricking me by not being on screen. Because I didn't go up enough. But there we go. Also, it's interesting that these enemies drop the 
the little tag to pull these off because that means that they have that the tag can go from anywhere on the screen to where they need to go. Which I mean that makes sense, but also the ones that we've seen up until this point always go along a specific path. DDD robe. This luxurious robe is amazingly comfy, even if it is a little big. Nice. Also, why does DDD just have all these things around the place in this castle? It's probably fine. Also, I have a bad feeling about going too far. Careful. Uh, is there something... Do I want to go down here first? No, probably not. Probably want to go up here first. Let's hit that. Okay. Secret, secret. That's how you know it's a secret. It's a secret, secret. Okay. Oh, hello. These enemies. Haven't seen them for a while. Okay, that's one. Shoot at me. Do it. Okay, that's one, that's two. Very nice. This is a very colourful room. I like it. There's the five stars. Okay. Let's go down now. So you could very easily skip the five stars if you didn't want to go up that way. But also, you probably do want it just to make sure you have everything. Okay, let's not go that way. Okay, so let's jump down here. Oh, carefully. Carefully, carefully, carefully. Without getting crushed by anything. I think if we go up here, is actually where we're going to get our last treasure, probably. Except I have to do better than... Nope, it's just a star. That's fine. Beads also helpful. Oh, don't go to the spikes. Oh, that was close. I was just walking away from the spikes. Somehow not getting pushed into them. Oh, I'm bad at platforming, apparently. But I think I already knew that, somewhat. I want to go up there, I think. I think I can do that probably better by just jumping like that instead of jumping from the cannonball. Okay, what's up here? Again, I really like the way that they do the the extra areas in Dreamland. Okay. Let's throw that up there. And I think I actually might have made a mistake. Somewhat. I need to be very careful to actually hit all of these, otherwise I'm gonna... ...ruin my chances. I think I got it. Which is good, because those ones on the top are really hard to hit. Unless you actually have a second player. Because then you can throw them up and they can deal with it. But in single player, you actually have to throw the... ...the other enemies on top of them so they explode. Which, if you fail, probably means that you miss it, otherwise you might... ...possibly be able to reset the room? Oh, it's Gourmet Race, of course, I... I don't know, I don't know what I was thinking. Anyway, I mean, it's... It's fairly normal to hear it with DDD, so it's hard, it's easy. Although we've already got the DDD thing, how haven't we? I don't know what I'm thinking. It's fine, I don't wanna, I know, I know now, and that's what matters. Also, hello! This is interesting. This is very interesting, this is a big bottle Z. Do I take him out? I guess so. Of course, that's the one that has that. That's that's why the the painting was so big. That's actually really cool. Okay, let's pull that open, please. And that has a statue of Deity behind it. But also, I feel like I'm missing something. Oh, uh, this is where I'm missing it. Also, I can see that star up there. I, I I don't know if I should get it first or if I should get it second. I don't know. I just need to make sure I get it. And that's what matters. Also, hello, you respawned. Also, whoa, that's a... statue... of... Yinyan. Apparently. I don't know when that got there, but that's cool. Okay, let's go down here and activate that. Do I want to go down? Okay, there's nothing there. Let's go up. Collecting everything along the way. No! My beads! Oh, my beads! Oh, my beads! Oh, my beads! I still have gold, at least. For now. Oh, my beads disappearing. I don't like the cannons. I mean, they're alright, but they're a little bit... Uh, they're just... Something about them just 
it doesn't work with me. It's probably because it's timing and I'm bad with timing. <laughs> As any anything that I've ever everything that I've ever played will show you, I'm bad at timing. I can get it like a quarter of the time, but not just. Oh, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Anyway, that's everything in that level. I'm pretty sure. And now, I believe it is time to use this bells of joy patch. To go to the end, to fight Yin Yan. Also, this is just really cool what he's done to Dreamland now. It's only temporary, but look at that. This is just so cool, and the music's changed. It's just, that's really cool. Let's go in. Inyan's using his powers to create Fangora. So we have to refight a few bosses probably. Also, I just I actually like the boss theme here. Which is probably weird to say because it's just it's all over the place, but I I, I, li I like it, so. Okay, bonus round. Oh fireballs, that's actually good because we can actually get some extra beads by doing that. Okay, that's fine. Dodge. Nope, it's more fireballs, that's Good for us. Come on, throw your tongue at us. <laughs> throw your tongue at me. Okay, no. Maybe just keep throwing these? I don't know. Need to wait for him to do the right attack so I can actually do things. Maybe I need to let him do his own thing. Just dodge for now. Yeah, that's what he wants me to do. Okay. Done one hit. Okay, Yin Yan, what are you going to do? person to the background. Oh, hang on. Need to be careful here. Also, I think I'm in trouble. Possibly. Or maybe not. Because he's putting these enemies in, and they stitch onto the screen platforms. Oh, but I need to stay up so I can actually get out. I need to... Ah. Uh, because, yeah, I need to get to the, the door if I can manage that, which is a little bit difficult. Also, I think the platforms only work from one side, possibly. Okay, hang on. Let's focus. Just going from platform to platform. They do disappear very quickly, so... No, my beads. Okay, get out so we can get to the next part. I only dropped a few beads, but that's okay. Okay, what's next? Oh. He's creating water on the bottom of the screen. So now we're underwater. Oh, hello. I remember this boss. Just need to be careful. Okay, is that one. Get rid of you. Give me your beads. Thank you. This is such a cool boss. I mean, it, yeah. It's just, I, just, I love this. Okay, what is he doing? Okay, he's doing crazy things. Making walls to be in my way. Let's get out, thank you. What's next? Oh, enemies. Let's get rid of all you. Get rid of all you. More enemies. Oh, no, 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 no. Get rid of all you. Throw that, so get rid of all you. Even hit Yin Yan. Let's do some damage. Very nice. We've done some damage to Yin Yan now. But now he's actually taken part of the floor away. So he can use it against us. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Just gonna dodge all of you, please. I don't know how I can dodge you. Oh, like that, apparently. Also, we need to be away from the 
big thing. Things that he's dropping us so we don't get knocked off the edge. We can also throw this at him to do some damage. But Yin Yan was actually just the the controlled thing by the knitting needles that he has. The knitting needles were the real enemy the whole time. Also, thank you, Meta Knight, for giving us tank bot form for this fight. Let's go. Tank bot versus tank bot. Basically just mash attacks, because that's all we can really do. We're gonna get a lot of beads from this, which is good, because we still need to get enough beads for the patch. Oh, careful. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Just do some damage. Imagine this is actually a lot easier in multiplayer because the second person can just, like, defend us from everything in existence. Oh, he's going crazy right now. He's going crazy right now. He's getting weaker. It's getting weaker. And there we go. And there they go. Oh, so that, play that plant looks familiar. With Yin Yang's spell broken, Dreamland returned to its normal state of peace and quiet. Well, I guess this is goodbye, Fluff said. It made Kirby sad to see his new friend leave. Buck up, Kirby. As long as you have this magic sock, you can visit me anytime. Until then, Fluff said as he returned to Patchland. And that's the story of how Kirby and Prince Fluff defeated Yin Yarn the Sorcerer and restored peace to Dreamland. So there we go. That's Kirby's Epigan. We're not quite done with it because there's a, a, a few more levels to play. And also all the minigames that I've not been going, haven't, haven't played all of yet, so. I don't know how that's going to go. I imagine I can get through them all. But this game is actually... It's pretty good. It's very well designed. It's very easy for me to lose all my beads. It's not extremely complex, but it's still... It's got a, it's very charming. I imagine if there was a harder mode to the game, it'd be really, really cool as well. Just to have that extra challenge. Also, the angel that picks us picks us up whenever we fall into a pit is also was also has a name because it's called a a a Angie. I think that's how they pronounce that. 
A-N-G-I-E. You can only know that if you look at the, the booklet, so... Or we'll probably look it up online, but... I really like the way that they do each world. Dreamland was the most unique world, probably. But I really enjoyed... Spaceland the most, I think. Especially with the last level of that. The next day, Kirby fell asleep in some shade. He dozed happily with wonderful dreams and held the reminder of a dear friend, even though it smelled a bit. Thanks for playing. That's a really cool image there, showing everything. Probably everything. But there we go. Got gold on that. Got a pretty decent streak. We also got Yin Yan's theme and the baseball bat patch. And also the theme from Dreamland. And also the tune from the staff credits. Well done, you've completed casts. Well done, you've completed films. Now, new items are now on sale. Come buy them, okay. Everything's just unlocked. But anyway, that is it for now. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.